I have a loader, you say. And immediately in the mind of the person that you're talking to, they think of this. No, 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 not a washing machine front loader. I've got a kind of loader that you can move dirt with. No, 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 not like that. That's way too big. I built a small loader on a lawn tractor. But what do you call it? Well, I don't know. It's a loader built on a lawn tractor. See, look at, look at what it can do. Not just move dirt, though. Cumbersome things, like lumber, can be moved. Heavy root balls of small trees or uh, shrubbery, things like that, to be taken to the pile to be burned. It can level ground. It does a really good job at leveling ground in my driveway. But that's not the end of it either. There's even more it can do. How about brush? Clippings from the shrubs that need to be taken to a pile to be burned or hauled off. Or how about trying this with, say, a wheelbarrow? You're not going to do it. Sure, you can haul dirt with a wheelbarrow, but you can't do this. Got to be a little careful there because that ladder rack is a little close to the top of that tent. But it pulls it right out, moves it easily. What do I call it? What kind of loader is it? Look here. I can use it to pick up heavy objects in my yard. Move them to places that are out of the way instead of right there in the middle of things. I don't even have to get off the tractor. How convenient. Do I call this a front loader on a lawn tractor? Is that what I want to call it? What do I call it? What do all these things have in common? Here's a generator that needs to be moved. That generator is about 150 pounds dry, but with oil and gas in it, it's pretty close to 200 pounds. It's kind of funny here to see this. Don't blame the loader. The loader is not cumbersome. It's me that's cumbersome. Better tie it down just to be sure. Make sure there's no uh, accidents. The loader picks it up with ease. Look at how far that thing is sticking out in the front. And yet, this small tractor, this small loader, can handle it. What do I call it? What do these things have in common with one another? What these images convey is that all of this work is of a residential nature. In addition, nearly every video I have seen of a small front loader build shows the work that is being done is of a residential nature. We builders and video makers have been referring to these loaders as a lawnmower front end loader, front loader on a garden tractor, homemade front end loader, front loader made from scrap, custom front end loader, and the list goes on and on. 
since these loaders are not likely to be used in a commercial setting, but are primarily used in the residential setting by the property owner or resident, I would like to propose the phrase residential loader or residential front end loader. Hopefully this has been inspiring to you. I'm going to use the term residential loader in my future videos. If you like what you saw, please click the like button. If you want to see more, please subscribe. Thank you so much for watching.